Former Prime Minister Raila Odinga claims there is a scheme by the government to intimidate the opposition leaders from pushing on with their reform agenda. Raila has termed the arrest of his strategist Devin Lee as a mere cover-up which is aimed at silencing the voice of the opposition. I know that other people are going to be arrested. But I want to say this for free to this government. The people of Kenya will not be intimidated into submission. The will of the people of Kenya cannot be suppressed through arrests, through prosecutions, through blackmail, through intimidation, through tear gas, through bullets, through water cannons. Lee was arrested on Sunday evening while on a private trip at the coastal town of Diani in Kwale County. His arrest coming days after he was chosen by the opposition alliance to lead a team of seven individuals to spearhead the creation and operations of the People's Assembly's a formation that NASA wants in its agitation for reforms. Speaking in Kisumu, the NASA leader condemned what he claimed was the excessive use of force by police on its supporters. The blood of those innocent Kenyans is in the hands of this government. They will have to answer. And we want to urge the world to stand up and talk. We urge friends of Kenya represented here through their diplomatic missions not to be quiet when innocent lives are being exterminated by trigger-happy police officers. Earlier, the top economist wife had also condemned the police for arresting her husband without following the laid down procedure. The head of the team who picked him, first of all, told me they're taking him to uh, uh, Diani police station. He never came. I was there from 9, from 9 all the way to 1.30 and he was never brought there. And even at that time, he gave me his number. I called him two times. The third time he stopped picking. We actually, I, I actually don't know where he is. The Director of Public Prosecution has, however, directed the Directorate of Criminal Investigations, DCI, to release D on a free bond. DPP Keriako Tobiko has also directed that once investigations are complete, the resultant inquiry file be forwarded to his office for directions. Ndi was airlifted from Mombasa to Nairobi where he was questioned at the DCI headquarters for the better part of Monday before being moved to Kilimani Law Courts. NASA leader Raila Odinga says the arrest of David Ndi is a clear intimidation by the government. But the NASA fraternity says they will continue with their push for reforms through the People's Assemblies. Reporting for KBC Channel One from CID headquarters here in Kiambu, I'm Ron Cliff. Audit.